When disaster strikes, will you be ready? That's the key question we're addressing today as we delve into the vital world of emergency preparedness. This isn't about fear, but empowerment, about taking control of your safety and self-sufficiency. This is your guide, the first stepping stone on your journey to becoming a fully prepared individual. We're here to demystify prepping, to break it down into understandable and actionable steps. Being prepared means being equipped with the right knowledge, skills, and supplies to face any type of disaster confidently. So, what does it mean to be a prepper? At its core, prepping revolves around three key principles, self-reliance, foresight, and resilience. It's not just about gathering supplies or learning survival skills, although those are important aspects. Prepping is a mindset. It's about anticipating potential challenges and proactively crafting solutions. It's about cultivating the ability to stand on your own two feet, even when the world around you is shaking. The key to successful prepping is understanding that it's a journey, not a destination. Now let's get practical. What's the first step in prepping? It's time to assemble your first emergency kit, the cornerstone of any preparedness plan. This kit is not a one and done deal, but rather a starting point that will grow and evolve with your needs and skills. Begin with the essentials. Stock up on non-perishable food items and clean drinking water. Aim for a three-day supply to start with, but remember, the goal is to eventually build up to a two-week reserve. Next, consider first aid supplies. Bandages, antiseptic wipes, tweezers, medical tape, and a range of over-the-counter medications are all crucial components of a well-rounded kit. Don't forget basic tools either. A multi-tool, a flashlight, extra batteries, a manual can opener, and a sturdy knife can be lifesavers in an emergency. Think of this kit as your safety net, your buffer against the unexpected. Remember, a well-stocked emergency kit is your first line of defense against any disaster. Preparedness isn't a one-size-fits-all solution. It's about personalizing your plan. In the world of prepping, understanding your unique circumstances is vital. It's essential to consider factors like your geographical location and personal circumstances. Think about your local climate, the natural hazards that may occur, and the resources available in your area. Are you in a flood zone? Is there a risk of wildfires? Once you've identified these potential threats, you're better equipped to tailor your prepping efforts. By identifying potential threats, you can tailor your prepping efforts to ensure you're ready for anything. You're not alone on this journey. There's a whole community out there ready to help. That's the beauty of the prepping world. It's a vibrant, supportive community, both online and offline. This community is always ready to share advice, resources, and moral support. It's a place where seasoned preppers meet novices, where knowledge is exchanged, and where camaraderie thrives. Connecting with others can be a vital lifeline, strengthening your resolve, and enriching your prepping journey. In the prepping community, you'll find a wealth of knowledge and camaraderie. Remember, we're all in this together. 